Hey guys, welcome to PJ's Coin Capers. So this arrived in the mail today, the Supercars 60 Years of Australian Touring Car Champions. Okay, so 1960 through to 2020. And uh, it's a big box. So uh, I thought we'd have a little look at the uh, at the packaging. It's, um yeah, literally it is big. And uh, looks like a, uh, what do you call that, a rocket cover on, a, on an engine. And a uh, little bit of detail there on the side. And then we have the Supercars logo there. And what does it say there? Australian. There we go. 1960 to 1920. Oh, sorry. 2020. 60th, 60th anniversary of the touring cars. So a nice uh, couple of logos there on the uh, on the side and nothing going on there all right so we'll open this guy up we'll have a look at the uh coins that are in here I'm not sure which way is the right way up but get it open hopefully okay all right we've got it the right way around all right so let's let's go through each of these coins okay so the first coin in here is the limited edition coin and this one here has a mintage of just 15,000. So in order to get this particular coin, you need to buy this box set. You can't buy this as an individual coin by itself. All the rest of them you can get individually uh, from the mint. And uh, well, I think they're about $15 each. This, this complete set is $140. $45 and you will have to pay $10 postage so this is the rare coin and uh, limited edition of 15,000 there is a close-up of it okay and it's quite a nice coin no color the rest of the coins we will look at do have color all right and a little bit of information on the back there and as you can see there it is limited to 15,000 all right so if you want the full set of nine coins you must get the set all right so we'll pop that one back in so it's all slotted uh, I like this uh, packaging I love the design all right so here we've got which one is this 1970 Holden HT Monaro GTS GTS 350 and Norm Beachley was the driver of this car and I'll uh, just zoom in a little bit there so you can have a closer look at that car so nicely colored coins in the same sort of style that they've done for the Holden and uh, the Ford coins and it uh, tells you a little bit about each of the cars in on the side here which i really liked actually so let's keep it moving slot that one in next we have the 1971 chevrolet camaro and that's the number seven there a famous car and uh it was that bob jane Let's have a little close up look at that one there. So all these coins are 2020 coins. Nicely done with the JC effigy. And a little bit more about each of the coins. And the mintage is unlimited on these ones. Next we have the what is that the Mazda RX-7. Loved these cars as a kid. I wanted one, and there it is. There. I really, I'm really enjoying the packaging that the Mint have coming out with recently. Uh, I like these carded designs, uh, and it's it's similar, like they've sort of gone similar with the way they've done 
the uh, the firefighters. It's the same. Yeah, same size. Pretty sure, pretty much the same size. So that's that just gives you an understanding exactly what these are, what these are like. And I'll show you the back there. There's the details on the RX-7. Uh, where were we? In there. Oh, a bit tricky to find their spots. All right, so now we've got the 1984 Ford XE Falcon. I remember these going around Bathurst. Dick Johnson. So... You either grew up a uh, a Ford fan or a Holden fan. I was always a Holden fan. But uh, here we've got the uh, 1991 Nissan R32. Now, my son is 17 years old and all he wants is, uh, is to have an R32. He would absolutely love to have a Skyline. And uh, he's saving up his dollars in uh, the hope of having one of these for when he turns 18 and gets his license so Riley hopefully that comes true for you all right and there it is there so he knows all about these cars he knows all the all the different models and has a good understanding of them all because he he absolutely loves them all right getting into a little bit more Modern era, so we've got Craig Lowndes 1998 Holden VS Commodore, and uh, it's a well known car and worthy of being uh, placed in this uh, in this set. All right, so we've got the year 2000 Holden VT Commodore driven by Mark Scaife. Try and get a little bit closer in on that one. What do you think of these coins, guys? Do you, do you like them? Uh, I don't mind them. I, don't, I like a bit of colour on coins. And uh, I like the way that they've done these sets. But um, the good thing is these are still available from the Mint. So it's, uh, it's nice to show coins to you guys that are actually still available. Because quite often coins have been selling out... Or these... Uh, sets have been selling out very quickly but uh as of today those things were still around so go and uh if you're interested in getting these sets i pre-ordered this a fair while ago probably a month ago what my guess is so this is the uh, 2008 ford bf falcon and that's the jamie wind cup car right there all right let's have a look at the other side so as i said they're available from the mint still now and uh 145 dollars what do you think guys what do you think of the price what do you think of the set they've certainly uh packaged it up very nicely the only issue with uh these big sets like this is they just they take up so much room in your uh in your collection that's the uh the only downside but uh, other than that it's um beautifully packaged nice tin and uh, certainly well well worth getting if you're a supercar fan or Holden or Ford fan. And uh, obviously, if you're into coin collecting, it's a great crossover. All right, guys. Hope you've enjoyed this little uh, look at uh, the brand new set. And uh, if you've been able to get one, what do you think? And let me know if you are going to get one. Or if you're not going to get one, tell me why you're not going to get one. All right, guys. If you've enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, make sure you do so. All right, guys. Thanks for watching and bye for now.